So I had the uh, the idea for another fight in the back of my mind. I was just like, fuck it, I'll just do both. So here we are, guys. Garnet versus She-Hulk. How would that go? She-Hulk and Garnet throwing down. Now, for those who don't know what She-Hulk is capable of, let me talk about it real quick. You see, her, bro her cousin, Hulk, you know, the Hulk, angry he gets, the stronger he gets... She-Hulk's not like that. Jennifer Walters is actually, you know, she keeps her level of intelligence, but and she is capable of lifting up to 75 tons, although I think that got a little that got lifted up a bit um, since then. But She-Hulk actually, yeah, she does retain her intelligence and she actually has superhuman you know, superhuman agility and a healing factor, um, as well as increased stamina. Among other things, She-Hulk is... She can't... Like I said earlier, she can't get stronger the matter she gets, but, you know, what she lacks in, you know, superhuman anger and strength, she makes up for in intelligence as well as, you know, she is a pretty decent hand-to-hand -hand fighter. She's no Shang-Chi, but she's pretty good. And you mix that with, you know, um, Hulk-like strength, yeah, you're, you're in for the money. <laughs> right there. So, um... More or less, you know, uh, She-Hulk is pro is listed as probably the strongest female character in the Marvel Universe. Actually, I think they're, she's the second strongest, or the th or either... Yeah, I think she's either the first or second strongest char female character in the Marvel Universe. But yeah, as She-Hulk, you know, as She-Hulk, she's gone up against monsters, gods, demons, all kinds of crazy shit, and she's still a prosecuting attorney. <laughs> yeah. But... Let's talk, but Garnet's no different either. You know, Garnet, of course, is a fusion, and, yeah, if you thought, you know, She-Hulk was tough, get a load of what Garnet can do. Garnet actually is the most powerful member of the Gems. She, you know, before, you know, I guess maybe she, when Rose was around, she was the second strongest, but with Rose gone, Garnet's now officially the strongest of the Crystal Gems on feud, well, aside from the fusions, because she is a fusion of Ruby and Sapphire. Now, Garnet is incredible. Like I said, the physically, the probably the physically strongest of the gems. Those gauntlets of hers can actually be extended as well as shot out like rockets that can explode, and she can just grow them right back. She's also a pretty decent hand-to-hand -hand fighter, and yeah, she's pretty durable. How durable, may you ask? Uh, she jumped in. It, it said once that she jumped into a river of lava. And didn't get burned up. Yeah, she did. You know, she quintessentially survived. You know, swimming through lava. You know, unhurt. I'm pretty sure if She Hulk did that, her skin would just be all, all burned the fuck up. So, you know, Garnet probably takes it out on stamina. But she has been defeated before. She has been poofed back into Ruby and Sapphire multiple. You know, a few times. And yeah, from that gem destabilizer. But still, Garnet is listed as probably the most powerful of the Crystal Gems, on, you know, outside of the other fusions, excluding herself. Now, Garnet is incredibly intelligent and has a special trick up her sleeve, that being her future vision. However, just because she has future vision doesn't mean it's not like, you know, pre like a spider sense where she can be like, oh, I saw your punch coming, or oh, I saw your kick coming, I can dodge that. It's not instantaneous. It's more like she sees the multiple choices of each event. She can see how each event can turn out and, you know, how to, you know, mold, the, you know, see from there. It's not like, oh, this is what we're doing. No, it's more like, oh, okay, I can see this, and this is what's going to happen if they do this, this is what might happen, or that might happen. It's like that. So it's not like a spider sense, per se. It's more like, oh, we're gonna fight, okay. <laughs> I wonder how this is gonna turn out. But Garnet, it, you know, she does have some hand-to-hand -hand combat skills, but it's more like just smashing. That's what I've seen so far in the Steven Universe show. It's not really, it's not so much hand-to-hand -hand fighting because she's a fucking tank. Um, she's more smash you. She's more smash you in the face rather than, you know, use any real skill to it. Um, that's the big thing I've seen is that she's not really, you know, she doesn't really do the, the whole kick, punch, kick, block, punch kind of maneuver. It's more like, I'm just going to punch you till you get de until you stay down. <laughs> as far as I've seen. But that's not to say she's stu that's not to say Garnet is stupid. It's just more like she depends too much on her strength where She-Hulk depends on brains and brawn in her fights. She depends on that agility. She depends on her, you know, trying to think out the situation, but she gets a here's the thing. Gar um She-Hulk gets a little too um she gets a little too cocky. 
you know, because of her strength. That's led to a lot of injuries to her. Garnet, on the other hand, cold, stoic, and knows what she's doing. And that is breaking your face. <laughs> so, if these two were to fight, this would be a pretty intense battle. I mean, I could imagine, you know, when their fists colliding, it would be like shockwaves and shit. <laughs> um, but both of them, you know, have very unique fighting styles. And, yeah... Like, kind of like Spider-Man, Jen likes to talk. She just loves to run her mouth and, you know, tease the bad guy, you know, tease her opponents. Garnet's more like, whatever. Because that would be the thing, like, She-Hulk would be running her mouth and Garnet would just be like, yeah, sure. And She-Hulk would just be like, oh, come on! I'm using my A-grade material here, get angry! Or, you know, make a joke, I want some banter here. <laughs> so that would be the... <laughs> <laughs> that would be the general of the uh, the general consensus of the fight is that you know Jen would just be running her mouth while she's fighting and Garnet would be like I let my fists do the talking. <laughs> anyway, so who do you guys think would come out on top in this matchup? If you think uh, Garnet would win, just put hashtag Garnet wins and just lift off, uh, list off the reasons why you think she the, uh, yeah she would come out on top. Or if you think She-Hulk would win, just put hashtag She-Hulk wins, list off the reasons why you think she would she would beat Garnet in this matchup. But anyway, once again, hope you all enjoyed this. Really looking forward to see what you guys have to say about this one. There are a lot of other female opponents um, that I was thinking about putting, you know, I always kind of had in my head of putting Garnet against, because there's so many, you know, good Marvel and DC characters to see Garnet throw down with. But I kind of gravitated towards She-Hulk because I feel like they would be to uh, total opposites in a one-on-one -on -one fight. And it, I started to think about it more and more. I was like, yeah, I wonder how that fight would go down exactly. But anyway, so once again, hope you all enjoyed this, and I will see you guys later.